Swift Current has many hidden parks and playgrounds that even many long-term residents don't know about. Have you been to all these hidden parks? Watch to the end to find out. Hi, this is Lori Dawn Stevenson with Century 21 Accord Realty in Swift Current, Saskatchewan. One park that is one of my favorite hidden parks is White Playground located on White Place, a small cul-de-sac on the upper northeast side of the city. This is a park that was just half a block from my dad's house when I was a kid and I spent a lot of time there. While it has a smaller playground, there is still plenty of fun to be had here. And you can benefit from the fact that many people don't know about this park and it's sure to be rather quiet and not as busy as some of the main parks often are. What about Buffalo Playground? No, not Billy Buffalo. This park has just opened back up after they replaced the full playground equipment. They've updated it to some fun new equipment and it's geared towards smaller kids. This smaller hidden park is situated just off of Walsh Trail and is actually only about two blocks away from the much larger Salto Park. Since it's designed more for younger kids, this park can let your kids run around and have a little more freedom without worrying about some of the bigger kids. Let's head over to Railway Park. This hidden park is just off of North Railway Street East in a small area that backs onto the train tracks. This park is made to look like a train, which is actually really cute. The kids love the climbing feature and this park Park is often quite empty too. This one is less of a hidden park but I feel like it's worth mentioning as well. Elmwood Park. This park has a large treed space that many people have gotten married in or hosted family reunions. Off to the side there is also a small playground and a fitness park, fun for adults and children alike. This one is on Chaplin Street East across the street from Elmwood Corner Store. Billy Buffalo Park, while also not too hidden, is a, another smaller park worth mentioning. Billy Buffalo Park used to be home to a large wooden buffalo and then down the line they had a really big concrete structure I believe it was and uh, now they've replaced it with a much smaller buffalo. Located across the street from the high school running track. And last but not least is a hidden park that I only learned about when doing some research for this video. Westlake Park. This park is on the upper south side, accessed primarily through either Bobeck Place or Elliott Place, but there's also a walk path that comes down from Burke Crescent too. There is ample green space and a decent playground for the kids to play on. Well, have you been to them all? We had a lot of fun going and trying these smaller hidden parks, and I hope you and your family will enjoy them too. This is Lori Don Stevenson, helping you move up to your Swift Current Dream Home.